This is a quick EDC update for January 2018. Um, not really a lot has, has changed since my last EDC update. That's pretty much why I haven't been doing them. Um, yeah. So, starting off um, down here, Case Sodbuster. I did a video on this knife. This is one of my favorite knives I own just because of the simplicity of it and, you know, the old school styling of the knife and everything, you know, it's a design that's been around forever. Um, it's a slip joint knife. It doesn't have a lock. Um, <clears throat> full size, pretty much full size knife. I think the blade's something close to three inches, if not three inches. I just really like this knife. The cool thing about this knife is it's not super intimidating looking because it's a style that's been around since, you know, like the early 1900s or longer than that even. So, you know, it's not, it's not an intimidating knife. <clears throat> so if I pull this out in public to open up a box or something, it's a lot less to fr likely to frighten people than uh, another knife because, you know, there's this section of the populace that think knives are weapons. And they don't really understand people like that because for me, a knife's a tool until somebody uses it as a weapon. But, you know, so yeah, case Oddbuster, been carrying that for a while now. Um, my wallet, still the Winchester, or Remington, sorry, wallet with the uh, fake um, shotgun key set on it. Still carrying a zip of lighter. I don't know if this one's different than the one I was carrying last time or not. This is the one that was a gift from a previous ex-girlfriend. It has my name engraved on it. I need to like to carry the Zippo because it has my name on it. Um, yeah. And then I got, still got this Streamlight Stylus Pro. Um, you can tell that I carry this thing with me every day because it is super, it's getting super beat up. I've dropped this thing on the pavement I don't know how many times while I'm trying to light up something and I'll lose grip on it and drop it on the ground. And it just continues to work. Um, you know, I, I really like this product from Streamlight. Um, yeah, it's just big enough of a light for what you need. Um, those of you who don't carry a flashlight every day, um, once you start carrying a flashlight, and if you like ever forget your flashlight or something, you really miss it, because flashlight comes in handy for a lot of things. Um, up here I have my keys. You will notice there's no car key on here. Well, there is a car key, but that's to my dad's truck. Um, I probably really don't need that car key, because I haven't driven his truck in like three or four years now. Um, I have my brass tag on here that a friend gave me from, I think it was from a water heater, um, cause he knows my favorite number is 13. Um, you know, I have my key to get in the house and I have my bike lock key because that's how I've been getting back and forth to work these past few months is on my bicycle. Um, you know, bike riding in the cold is fun, by the way. It's, it's very, very fun. Um, still got my CZ P09. Um, nine millimeter handgun inside of it are, um, 19 rounds of Hornady American Gunner. I think this is their 124 grain, um, plus P hollow point. That's what's in the magazine of the PO9. And then when I'm not carrying that gun, I'm usually carrying this gun, <clears throat> which is the Ruger LCP in 380. Um, you know, a lot of the times I'll carry both these guns, but usually if I don't have that gun, I have this one. Um, you know, just have a gun, basically. Um, but yeah, so this gun, this gun sucks to shoot, by the way. It's super uncomfortable. It hurts the crap out of your hand. Um, but it fits that important, um checklist of being a gun and it's small enough that I can carry it every day with me pretty much in spots where I can't carry this one um so yeah so that's it for my EDC for January of 2018